All right, so here's what I have on the shelf so far. I'm not finished with it. I think I'm going to have to run to Walmart, get more leaves, more pumpkins. This is going to end up going on the front porch because it will no longer fit on the shelf. I have my one last leaf. I'm going to see if I can pull away some of the greenery over there and put it on there. If not, I might just set it up on the bar top. But for now, I get to run to Walmart and get some more leaves and pumpkins and uh, something to put in her head. <laughs> Yay. Made it to Walmart a hundred dollars later. Got some wants, got some needs. Got some things for my goodie box for Katie. Here's the box. I'm going to put all of her goodies in here and send it off to her. I love, well, I love to shop, but I also love to give gifts. And so, yeah, I just want to make her a fun goodie box and send that off tomorrow. I got a medium and two small boxes to consolidate this box of stuff that my son decided he wants to keep. So there was, let me, let me move y'all down. Y'all are just a little too high for me, okay? There we go. So there is a black vase at Walmart for like 10 to $15. And it's got the little handles. It's the type that's in, it's small. And I've been looking at it, and I was like, ugh, I really should pick that up. Whatever, sat and thought about it. It's gone. Somebody figured it out that it was there, because usually something like that would be um, with the household stuff. But this was, like, tucked away in that aisle with the faux flowers and the small faux plants. Whatever, missed out on it. I can try another Walmart and see if they have it. But I did see this one, and I just thought, neutral, beautiful. How pretty will that be with some fall florals in it? So I love that. I got that. I got a full colored, just a neutral colored uh, dish drying mat for like two dollars and something. I got four more pumpkins and four more leaf, leaf stems. They have just thrown them in a box and people are, you know, I don't, mm. They're bent. I tried to get four of the best ones I could find. Whatever. Okay, so I got that. Hopefully by the time you see this video, Katie will have received her goodie box. Um, I bought this for $1.98. It's 12 spiders, and I can just put them on my put them on my wall at work. I do have some foam spiders that I got from the dollar store, so I don't know why I got these. I just, you know, I have I have issues. Um, I bought this to seal up packages and boxes and things when I start sending off happy mail. That was like ten dollars. 
on clearance. This is one, two, three, four, five, six rolls of washi for Katie's box. And then I got her just four various alphabet stickers in case she wants to write something out in her planner. She can use these. And then I got her a set of jelly rolls in case she wants to white out lines. And the 1.0 is the one that's going to work the best, but you might be able to get the others to work as well. To me, they're a little too thin. They scratch. Yeah, whatever. All right. A little bit more decorating, and then this video will be done. All right, everybody, it's not anywhere near being done. I finally pulled out one bin and put up the new things, <laughs> and I feel like it's enough. We'll see. What I know I've got to add to my crows and a few other spaces, but I wanted to show you my progress. Alright, so this is at the front door. Yeehaw, exciting. Okay, so then we come in and we see a very bad kitten. Are you a very bad kitten? Hmm? You are. You don't look like one. You look like a lion. Haven't done anything there. You'll have that there, greenery there, a terrarium with greens and whites and browns in it down there. It always stays the same. A chair with another pillow and stains from cat barf. That's great. We love having animals.
Not finished this area yet. Gonna have to go get more leaves and pumpkins.
One last update. Promise. Well, I can't promise. I might do more. <laughs>